student success begins with understanding that every student arrives at MSU with different academic and personal history and the College of Engineering is committed to the success of all of those students. The work we're doing would not be possible without the benefit of experts from the College of Education in understanding student motivation and without experts from the College of Engineering who understand the unique characteristics of an engineering undergraduate experience. One of the things that makes our collaboration so special is that we're able to bring unique viewpoints. So from my work thinking about students' persistence in STEM and, for example, Pat Walton's work that was originally with the core program that was focused on student success, we're really able to dive into what are those things that are important in engineering that make a difference for students' persistence. Our work focuses on understanding how those resources are useful to students by encouraging their motivation or by encouraging their feelings of belonging or their engineering identity development and even allowing us to determine how those resources might be useful and when it's best for students to experience those supports to achieve the greatest effect. We have a couple of different projects that we're doing related to student success. One of them is called C, which stands for Supporting Excellent Engineers. And in that project, uh, we have funding from the National Science Foundation to support high need, high talent students. And we provide a variety of different resources, but in particular, um, a, an important component of that, in addition to financial support, is the support of the mentors. Mentoring is a key component for this work that we have been doing here in the College of Engineering because we need to make sure that students' persistence, which is attached to their sense of belonging, is supported by giving them each other, giving them also some experiential learning opportunities, and just showing them that this is something that they can do. Within the College of Engineering, um, the C Scholarship Program Mentorship, the Diversity Programs Office, and the Core Leader Program helped me work on my communication skills, they helped me keep stay motivated, and they gave me an area where I could study with like-minded individuals who not only looked like me, but worked just as hard as I did. In thinking about how a student's environment and their support structures can serve their success, I think there's a lot of research um, and evidence to suggest that students really benefit from those support structures that are set in place, such as diversity experiences, and they have a diversity office. Now that office has really served students in terms of providing specific and guided mentorship, as well as being around and being exposed to students that are much like them and potentially have similar lived experiences. Our research is also looking at factors that help to support historically underrepresented students. And we do that with both our quantitative data, where we have a, such a large sample, we're able to look at processes specifically for students who have been historically underrepresented. But we also do that in terms of our qualitative interviews to try to understand the specific processes that either supported or hindered students' persistence. One part of computer science focuses on broadening participation. So we're providing more opportunities for black and brown students to learn about computer science. So the goal is to bring computer science experiences for all students. And even if a school doesn't offer computer science, students can get exposed to computer science uh, within the context of these uh, disciplines. What I'm really excited about our work is that they're not just working on abstract computer science problems, but they're really using computer science to explore issues, their own interests, and problem solve things within their own community and using computing as a tool for uh, civic engagement. So I'm really excited about where this work is going between the College of Engineering and the College of Education. We are in a unique position to be able to look at how we can support engineering students' persistence by taking the research we've done so far and better understanding what works in terms of supporting students' motivation and how we can enact that. We also know that we need to continue to explore the best ways to support all students in their success and we're excited about the opportunities our work will provide to make engineering degrees a reality for more students each and every year.